The Sarasota Manatee Jewish Federation is celebrating 50 years of giving back to the community. And now it's opening its doors to the public this week so that you can find out more about it. SNN Local News 6 reporter Jessica Jordan joins us live at the Sarasota Manatee Jewish Federation to tell us more about how this organization has grown so much over the years and who it has reached out to. Jessica. Well, Lauren, the Jewish Federation is growing in membership, and they say that's a direct mirror of the growing religious community right here in Sarasota and Manatee counties. Fifty years after its start, the Sarasota Manatee Jewish Federation is growing. I've seen this community grow by leaps and bounds. When I came here uh, in 67, there were just a few hundred Jews. Now there are over 20,000 Members say the Federation is the umbrella organization for Jews in the community, covering synagogues and national organizations. Sheldon Gensler was the first president of the Federation 38 years ago. He says the programming of sponsored classes, activities and workshops are better than they were just five years ago. When we first started in 1971, we operated out of an office of 600 square feet in the 1900 main building across from my law office. Then we outgrew that, and then finally, in the 1980s, we built this building here, which is the headquarters. These members contribute to providing educational programs, financial assistance, and scholarships to Jews of all ages, but their services reach beyond their religious community. We uh, help the needy. We, we work hand-in-hand hand with United Way, and we support a lot of community organizations. In honor of the Federation's 50th anniversary, members will host a free event that's open to the public Sunday from 12 to 4, and will also debut a film about early Jewish Federation leaders in the 1950s and 60s through today. Reflecting on their history and achievements is something Federation board member Claire Levin believes has kept the organization successful. There was a lot of work to be done because we have a 5,000-year history of Jews helping Jews, which is why we were told by our parents, and I agree, and I tell my children, that's why we're still here. Now, on Sunday, Federation members will unveil a brand new logo, and they're really marking this 30th anniversary as a milestone to mark how much they've how much they've grown over these past few decades. Live in Sarasota County, I'm Jessica Jordan with SNN Local News 6. Lauren? Jessica, I know there are a lot of events happening this weekend. Are there admission costs um, attached to those? Uh, there is no admission cost, but Federation members are asking attendees to bring an unwrapped toy, and that will go towards their toy drive to benefit the Jewish Family and Children's Services. Lauren? All right, Jessica Jordan reporting for us. Thanks, Jessica.